Welcome to this week's edition of Connective TV. I'm Michael Gurner. Well, I'm back fresh this week after Jess substituted for me last week in doing Connective TV from the MFAA convention. What a great three days it was there in Adelaide. Anyway, let's get on with the changes to the lenders this week. St George, Bank of Melbourne and Bank SA have announced changes to their Advantage Package Life of Loan Discounts. When the total borrowings are 100,000 to 149,000, the discount will be 0.25%. 150,000 to 249,000, 0.7%. 250 to 499,000, 0.75, and above 500,000, 0.8%. There's also a $700 refinance rebate. The refinance rebate is for all loans under the Advantage package that originated between Friday the 1st of June and Tuesday the 31st of July. As it's getting closer to the end of the financial year, ANZ have announced that there's possibilities to save for your clients with interest in advance. Just a reminder that in the lead up to the end of the financial year, your customer may benefit by fixing part or all of their investment loan and paying the interest in advance prior to the 30th of June 2012. By doing so, investment loan customers may be able to claim the interest as a tax deduction in this financial year. There are many lenders offering this interest in advance facility. Adelaide Bank has announced a reduction on the variable rate for their commercial smart suite loans. The rate has immediately been reduced by 0.3%. You should consult Mercury to see the latest and greatest updated rates for commercial products from Adelaide Bank. BMC, the Better Mortgage Company, has announced that they are no longer able to sustain a non-clawback policy. Effective from the 1st of June, clawback will now apply for all new business. The clawback will be 100% in the first 12 months and 50% of the upfront in the second 12 months. After that, zero will apply. Liberty Financial announced last week that they have reduced the standard variable rate on their SMSF loan. The new standard variable rate, effective immediately, is now 6.99%. If you want to know more about the Liberty SMSF product, contact your local BDM. While still on the subject of self-managed super funds, Macquarie last week announced that they are entering the market in this area. They have launched a limited recourse SMSF loan and for all, more information you just need to contact your local BDM and all of the contact details are available on Mercury. Bankwest, Home Loans, Westpac and Suncorp were amongst the many banks and mortgage managers to announce reductions to their fixed rates last week. Obviously with the current environment out there, fixed rates are looking attractive for clients. So please ensure that you go to Mercury and look at the latest fixed rates should your client ask for them. And remember to look out for the weekly bulletin which was sent out last Friday. With the continued success of Connective Home Loans, we're really expanding the team. And we've just appointed recently Rachel in, in Queensland. Uh, we've put Rodney on in New South Wales to join Mel. And here in Victoria, we've got Terry Walker. And Terry joins us today. Welcome to the team, Terry. Thanks, Michael. Great to be part of it. And what are you looking forward to doing with uh, Connective Home Loans? Oh, uh, look, as an extension of the team and the support that we've been able to put on the ground, um, meeting the members, providing that wonderful service that Connective Home Loans is becoming famous for, and getting out there and really promoting our product and looking at that bond between Connective and the Home Loans product. Uh, that's good, that's good. There's been a, a, a really good take up of Connective Home Loans and yep. mate, you're just the, uh, basically the, the proof in the pudding that uh, things are going well and we're expanding the team there. That's yeah, really good. Great to be on board. Just a reminder too that uh, Connective Academy during July, we're going regional. In WA we'll be running in, one in Bunbury, in the Northern Territory we'll be running one in Darwin, in Queensland one in Townsville, in New South Wales we're heading to the ACT in Canberra and down here in Victoria, we'll be going to Geelong. Now this is the first time that we've run these regional academies, so you'll need to make sure that you get in and register fast. So get onto Mercury and make sure that you register so you don't miss out. Last week we looked at smart credit. How do you put yourself in the shoes of the credit person? This week, we're going to look at a topic that's close to all of your hearts, I'm sure, valuations and an aspect of those valuations that I'm sure you're all familiar with, issues with valuations. Next 
week we'll be looking at crunch time. That's right, settlement and what happens in this important part of the transaction. Well it'll be interesting to see what the RBA do tomorrow with the cash rate. Obviously everyone's very interested in what's happening with that rate at the moment, especially your clients. If you want to know more about my marketing, please contact your broker support manager and we would be happy to go through that with you. Anyway, that's all this week from Connective TV. I'm Michael Gurner. Goodbye.